Good evening, boys. Bobo, wanted to see me, boss? Yeah, hey, boy, do you want a title match? Yeah, indeed I do. For the TCW Tag Team Championship? Yeah. <laughs> How about the good old boys? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Which one of my boys do you want? Well, I've got three words for you. Mr. Riviera, you just say those three words and it's done. Release the hounds. <laughs> the following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the TCW Tag Team Championships. Introducing first, representing the Bradford family and accompanied to the ring by the manager for the ages, Boyd Bradford, at a total combined weight of 535 pounds, the team of Rosen of the Dog and Cerebus. There they are, Cerebus, Roosevelt, and the icky Boy Brad. The what? Icky. He just got Icky. creepy, nasty, clammy hands, schemer. All those different words I think you can use to describe him. Really? These guys are drinking the Kool-Aid from the Bradford family. The TCW Tag Team Champions from Taterpeel, Tennessee. Right. And a total combined weight of 540 pounds. The team of Jeremiah Plunkett and Jeremy Flint. The good old boys. That is not urine. I want to clarify that. That is actually well. It's probably as large as that stinking moonshot these guys carry. Thanks. Have you ever tried just a little swig of that? No, I've never will. I don't know how they can drink it. I don't know. This is what I've heard. I've tried it a little bit. You probably have. You're disgusting just like these guys are. The good old boys. You want to talk about icky? They're icky. You know what's crazy about this is that we have Cerebus and Roosevelt who have been told by Matt Riviera, hey, go out there and win those tag team titles. That's, For me. That is the deal that has been made. He said, at least the hounds and the hounds are here. Cerebus and Roosevelt. We've seen a little bit. Finally, Roosevelt, I think, maybe just starting to turn around a little bit, starting to get that mean streak back in him. His leader, Cerebus, leading the way for that effort. I like, I like what I'm seeing. I hope I see more of it from Roosevelt. When Cerebus came to TCW Wrestling, he was, he was upset with what he saw when he looked at Roosevelt. He thought that Roosevelt had, had gotten weak in the time where, where Cerebus was away. We know that he had to go away for a while, for a long while. He did. He's having to bring this back with Roosevelt. And yes, we have seen a different guy. But there you see your tag team champions, the good old boys. Jeremiah Plunkett on the inside, Jeremy Flynn on the outside. Here you know, we I go. Love, I love a good business deal with you have two smart businessmen like the boss himself, Mr. 5.5, Matt Riviera, and Boyd Bradford. I like seeing something like that. I take notes. I learn from, from great businessmen like that. You can learn a lot from them, too. How much money do you think is involved in this transaction? Oh, it's all about the money, right? It's all right, pal. It's more money than you'll ever see on a paycheck. <laughs> I mean, who tells guys? We've seen this for the last couple of weeks. Matt Riviera is sending people out to do his dirty work. Hey, go beat oh, this guy. Wow. Go take this guy out. Go win these oh. championships. No, he's making smart business decisions. He's trying to call every single shot. He's the boss. Speaking of boss and service here, he's trying to be an example for his younger brother. Look at this. Let's see what kind of tag team continuity they have. Oh, watch out, though. Plunk it. Fires away at Roosevelt, fires away at Cerebus. Bam! Oh. These good old boys are fired up. They had some momentum. Well, you know, they were, <laughs> I guess, they got, might have got a little peeved. Uh, <laughs> peeved. Will you stop with the pee and urine jokes? <laughs> Matt Riviera's urine, if you don't recall, was dumped over the head of the good old boy's cousin, Jamie J. Yes, it was a... A, a little bucket of urine that Riviera... Riviera won't leave his office. He pees in, in little buckets now. I just think you're in a state of confusion. Oh, <laughs> Watch out, though. No confusing this right here. Cerebus caught off guard here, I think, by, by Plunkett. 
Jeremiah Plunkett of the good old boys. They came in here and, and literally stole the TCW Tag Team titles from the Empire. I'm gonna try to grow those chops, those little chop things he has in his face. I like that, those butt chops. Oh boy, that would, would be- that look good? Yeah, sure, buddy. You go, you go with that. <laughs> I like hanging out with these guys. I bet you They're do. They're fun. Oh, that's sick! Oh, no! That is gross! Well, that's that the is... pits. <laughs> oh, oh, now you're a comedian, too. <laughs> What, are you going to have your own radio show sometime or something? <laughs> Give me a break. I wouldn't want to do radio, would uh, I? I don't know. I'd much rather do television. Yeah. You should go back to the facial part of it, though. <laughs> Here we go. Cover by Jeremy Flynn. He has Roosevelt. I can't. That was nasty. That was pity city. Get, ew, uh, ew. This, it was disgusting. Yeah. And these aren't the, the cleanest two guys as no, far as, you know, like, let's go and... And, well, and be well groomed. Yeah, I mean, please. Like, they've had a bath in the last six weeks. I wasn't going to go that far, but no, I, I don't did. think they would mind going a couple days if they were having a good time. Couple? What? I think these are the kind of guys who might sit around, eat some pizza, fall asleep, wake back up, eat some more pizza. Yeah. They're not going to be Continue. like you. They're nothing like a man like Boyd Bradford who gets offers from magazines like GQ to be on the cover all what? the time. Oh, yeah. GQ. Watch out. And Boyd Bradford. <laughs> Huh. He's a gentleman, and you see the way that right there Roosevelt tried to help out, but it didn't matter at this particular point in time. Cerebus in trouble. Good old boys seem to have the edge. It's not going to last long, though. Cerebus has Roosevelt doing his bidding just oh. right. All is right in the world with the Bradford family. Come on. Look at Plunkett, though. This is why these guys are the tag team champs. Uh-oh, here we go. Cerebus has him. Uh -oh. Oh, wow. That one will give you a negative attitude. I think Tag Team Gold comes to the Bradford family right now. Oh. Again, so service like a buzzsaw, man. He'll just go. He doesn't back down. He'll tear you up. He'll chop you up. There's certainly no give. And a man like that. That's just a vicious. See, look, look how look how vicious. I like that. A little more vicious from Roosevelt. Yeah. Get I a agree. little bit even more vicious. Come on. This is your chance. Yeah, do that. Rearrange his face. The tag team titles are on the line, and this match will continue ah. after this. Look at that. Oh. Cerebus tags back into his brother, Roosevelt. Very and different Roosevelt. guys when you look at him. Now look at this. Roosevelt locking something in here. Oh. Was he gnawing on the head? No, well, no, I mean, no. <laughs> no, he wasn't. Was he? <laughs> All right. Uh. All right, the comedy hour continues with Brian Thompson. Just call it how I see it right down the line, Jack. That's how I do it. Roosevelt shoots him across. No reversal. Oh. Plunkett now takes that boot. Roosevelt to the middle. Comes off with that flying forearm and elbow. Goes for the cover. Oh, look at that leg hook. Not quite enough right there. Actually kind of put him in an ill position right there, causing the break courtesy of Jer Jeremy Flint, who had a clean shot right at Roosevelt. But here comes the big brother. Cerebus is in now. And he says, yeah, they made a tag. It was boy, if Boy Bradford says it's true, Brandon Baxter, I mean, come on. Yeah, it's not true. Wait, what? Yeah, exactly. What? The whole complexion of the Bradford family has changed since Cerebus has been here. Well, that is a valid point. Cerebus brings out the bad, bad side of the Bradford family. That's actually good for the Bradford family. Oh, I like it. Wow. He has him down. Cerebus drove the head. And all that weight of Jeremiah Plunkett face first, forehead first into the canvas. His neck had to go almost like a like a slinky even. Oh yeah. Yeah, you you felt it. It just kind of jars your neck. Your neck is not supposed to compress that way. Compress vertebrae, very painful. That's the kind of thing that haunts you for the rest of your life you too. Still, yeah, I see you pop your neck once in a while as a result of things like that. Look out! Here comes Plunkett. Plunkett needs to get to the corner. Come on. Can he get to the corner? Same thing for Cerebus. He needs to make a tag. Well, his own partner's in the ring. They're both, both down. This is crazy. Jeremy Flynn trying to rally down. the crowd. Can he get there? Can he make that tag? Oh, this thing's about to break loose right here. He got he it. He does. Here it comes. Watch out. Here comes Jeremy Flynn. Everything is breaking down. This thing is pandemonium. Referee losing control of this contest. All four men in the ring right now. Bam! Big elbow. The good old boys. That's a break. They Whoa. need the lights. Cerebus down. Cerebus took a high trip right there. Good old boys. The tag team titles are on the line with the good old boys. Oh, it looks like they're set to retain. Oh. Is that going to be it? 
Referee gonna count one, two. No, oh. Cerebus in. Cerebus, perfect timing right there. Saw the opportunity, broke up the pin attempt. Could have been over had that not happened. Tag team titles at stake here, Brandon Baxter. Matt Riviera wants the tag team titles, but he doesn't want to get in the ring to wrestle, so he sends out Roosevelt oh, and Cerebus. That. That's exactly just, what this I is. I just call it good business. Oh my gosh, is he gonna? Oh, look at this. Is he gonna be able to carry him? Oh, oh wow. Drops him hard on his back. Plunkett is down. Cerebus goes for the cover. Two. Two. No. Oh. Not quite How? enough. I thought we had new tag team champs for a sec. Even Cerebus, look at the look on his face. He's asking the question, how? How on earth did Jeremiah Plunkett survive? Roosevelt wondering the same thing at this point. Roosevelt, Cerebus, Double take team. him in. Let's take a look one more time. I thought this was going to be it. Right here, Cerebus drops it down. Live action back in the ring. Plunkett goes for the cover on Roosevelt. He planted him down. Where's the referee? Referee is concerned Richard himself. Richard turn around. Wait Only a, a two count. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. He didn't. Wait a minute. Oh, it's the boss. Look who's, look who's out of his office. He's got a present for the good old boys. <laughs> it's the Empire. Why does he they have better, that teddy bear out here? They better watch out. Referee's going to have to get Jeremiah Plunkett back in there. Wait a minute. Wait on the to inside the ring. of the ring. To the ring. On the inside of the ring. Oh. Cover, get a referee, get in the ring. Referee, get in the ring. Oh, no. Yes. Oh, no. Yes, one, two, no. three out. We have two. Oh, we have two. Tag team champions are standing. Oh, man. standing. We have new TCW Here are your tag winners. Team champions. Yes. And new yes. TCW Tag yes. Team Champions. The team of Cerebus and Rose. The dog! Matt Riviera oh, got exactly what he wanted. Oh, glorious day, Brandon. Glorious day in wrestling history. New tag team champions. The tag team championships of TCW now rest solidly in the hands of the Bradford family.